and but the grilling the functionality of these grills is amazing which is why they're super expensive in retail we have a $200 savings compared to the retailers. So we are thrilled about that. We have three colors available for you as we get this next hour started in the beautiful outdoors. We have green, we have the copper, and we have it in the cinnamon, which is that beautiful red in the front. Now it's not just the grill that you're getting. You'll notice this doesn't look like a typical grill because it is not. This is a wood fired grill and smoker. My favorite thing we've ever done are the briskets. Low and slow, as they say, but ribs and chicken and burgers and can do it all with a lot of uh, cooking space. As you can see, a couple different levels. You've got this cooking or prep station and tray up here. This is the hopper. This is where you put your hickory or your mesquite wood chips in. And guess what? We give you those too. So I just wanted to quickly show you the colors. And then I wanted to share you that we're giving you two 20 pound bags of both mesquite and hickory wood pellets. So you get that wonderful smoky flavor uh, for whatever it is that you are in the mood to make or to grill this summer. And guess what? Sky is the limit. This is not just a grill that limits you to just to be able to grill. It does so much more. There's a never ending learning process when it comes to barbecuing. And so we turn to the master herself, the barbecue master and champion, Danielle Bennett is joining us live here at HSN for this very Barbie. special hour. Danielle, welcome. How are you? It's so great to be back. Yay, me, I know, it's that time of year again. I love barbecue. <laughs> and you know, I always like to say, because it is always 365 days a year. Yeah. I know everybody gets excited as soon as that, you know, the spring, the summer comes along, but I barbecue all year round. And I have got some loaded grills today to show you. Are you ready for this? Come on, we gotta start right over here. I'm gonna give you a close up shot of what I've been working yes, on all night do. and all day. Oh. All right, we're going in for it. Let's see, we've got a tomahawk today. Ooh. My boy's here taking pictures. <laughs> got to give a shout out to Dakota. There we go. And we've got the the animation. All right. So we've got we've got the animation that shows that we have such an easy time using the Traeger grills. So basically, what you do is you fill the hopper with wood wood fire pellets, all natural wood, and that auger pulls the pellets through. How amazing is that? I tell you what, I'm now, so as the entire, you know, entire grill is filling up with that wood fire smoke, you load your grill up. It's going to envelop with all that delicious flavor, and then all the grease is going to go in that little bucket on the side. I know. How amazing is that? I love that. And no, in see, fact, I'm going to show everybody what you're getting here. I want to make sure you understand because you don't need to get anything after you get this on its way to, by the way, on FlexPay, it's $120. This is an $800 grill, not here at HSN. You're saving $200 as opposed to retail. And then we give you these huge bags. This isn't like a little, oh, a starter bag. Look at the size of both of these. There's one hickory and one uh, mesquite. I still have tons of the wood pellets because I did buy mine two summers ago and absolutely love it. I love the look of it. That little side hopper that Danielle was just mentioning is where you put those wood pellets. By the way, this comes with a three year warranty, but it is for everything, not just your obvious, but from grilling to smoking, you can slow cook, you can bake, you can braise, you can barbecue. There's tons of great recipes online. If you just go to Traeger.com, that's what we do. It's like, well, what, what, what would this taste like? We've had the best time with our grill in the backyard. As a matter of fact, you're gonna see here, I mean, the festivities, let them begin. It's all about family, getting together in the backyard. But the grill master, if that's you at home, you don't have to be sitting there for hours on end unless you're just grilling up some burgers. To do the slow cooking, and all of the information is right there on the dial of that little hopper. Uh, in fact, follow me over here and I'll show you what that looks like. Oh, one more thing I get to tell you is that this is on VIP financing. If you have an HSN card, you can do this for 12 months, but you'll get it delivered like now. That's like $50 a month. 
That's all it is, $50 to get yours back in your backyard and get started with the summer barbecue season. As I just reveal, the multiple layers that you can go ahead and cook. That back shelf, whether you do your fruits, your vegetables up top, I mean, these burgers are just gonna be total perfection. Not quite ready yet, we're gonna let that continue. But look at this, the cast iron skillet, you can put that in the back and let it just do its slow cooking. I think that's the key, don't you, Dan uh, Danielle, is that low and slow, being the barbecue master that you are, I mean, this is your world. And I know one of the things that Danielle said is she's like, I have never met a barbecue that I don't like. Uh, she lives and breathes and eats barbecue. She is a champion, and many of you recognize her uh, for what she has done in the, to the world of you know backyard barbecuing. But take one, oh, by the way, before we go back to Danielle, I wanna show you what the colors are because I don't want you to miss yours. I'll give you an update. These are just now back in stock. Traeger at $200 off compared to retail. Ooh, we got a nice breeze coming through right now. Uh, this is the really pretty green. It's like this deep evergreen. I think that is so pretty. Love the little chimney over there. It just looks so cute. Um, the next to one to that is the, I believe we're calling that bronze, which is available, and I love the look of that. In the front down below, we've got this in cinnamon. So if you like a little pop of color, it's more of a red than a deeper brown red, just putting that out there. Um, my guy, Tracy, and I, we put this together not, it didn't take us maybe 30 minutes. You just attach the major, you know, components as you would if you bought this in one of your, you know, gardening stores and spent $200 more on it. This is on sale and here's the big thing, free shipping. Free shipping on a product that, uh, let's just say it's not light. I mean, it is, it's a substantial piece. This is gonna, in fact, weighs over 120 pounds. So put it where you want it. And if you want to move it around, it does come with those heavy duty wheels. So you can go ahead and you know, move it from area to area. What I think is amazing, two things I want to share with you. Sorry to, to I'm so excited about this product because I own it. This is the information that you can see. You can put it at the exact temperature that you want it. If you're doing the low and slow, because you're doing like a nice rack of ribs, slow is the way to go. But you can see you've got the complete customizability right there. And it tells you when you're smoking or if you're going way up to high, if you want to add your temperature probes, you can do that to check the you know interior temperature of what it is that you're doing. Whether it's chicken or fish or anything in between, your corn on the cob, your vegetables, your roasted vegetables, but my favorite thing, that we've done, because we've tried a lot of different things, the brisket. You know brisket needs to be sitting somewhere for hours on end, and there's that flavor or the smell in the air that just makes my mouth water just thinking about it. Um, so it's just really cool the way it's customizable. And then I wanted to show you this. Because some grills, I mean, it gives you like this much cooking surface. Like really? When you've got a neighborhood or you know family gathering together, you want to go big or go home and look at how much food you can cook all at the same time. Let me grab my spatula so I can flip these for you. I love a nice char or a sear to my burger, so I'm gonna probably let these go a little bit longer. And who knows, I might have adjusted that temperature when I was showing you where that part of the, the grill is. Now we're coming along. And look at the corn in the cob. I mean, you wanna get those grill marks, you can totally do whatever you love most. My son is all about the vegetables, so we do a lot of vegetables on this second tier, and that's the beauty. In fact, I have the information on the, on the surface or the cooking area, but I do, and I'll get that for you, but I love that there's this side, front tray and the side tray right over here. So if you've got more hot dogs that you're gonna be throwing on the grill, you've got places to put them. Then I wanted to share with you this because I own this grill. I know it very well. This is where if there's any drippings, there's this little extra bucket to be able to con you know, contain it, all the oils and things like that. It's not gonna make a big mess on the ground uh, around where you are cooking. So this is the world famous Traeger here at HSN. $200 savings, no charge to ship. And it's gonna be there in no time to really celebrate. Uh, what we've all been waiting for, and that is the nice warm weather. Whether it's, you know, spring, summer, truth is, winter and fall, we grill all the way around the clock. 
Look at this chicken, the way this chicken turned out. Because you know, the way the, the Traeger grill is designed in terms of its shape, it's more of like the convection kind of cooking that you're gonna enjoy. And that's why this golden crisp, crispy skin on the top of the chicken is so mouthwatering. It doesn't, you know, it just really, it sears in the flavor and the moisture, leaves that nice crispy exterior, that nice crispy crunch, just the way you want it. Oh my gosh, look at this. That's what I'm talking about. A beautiful brisket. If you wanted to do a big rack of ribs, you could feed an army. But all the delicate things, because of the way Traeger has perfected their grilling process, things don't fall apart. And they just maintain their, their, their flavor, their tenderness. I love that you can even do such things as a pizza. How about making your grill a pizza oven? You can. That's the beauty. Traeger is so much more than just a grill. You can bake. Look at this. We've baked a cornbread with some beautiful sliced jalapenos. That looks absolutely amazing. But this is where it's at. When you think about summer, you think about barbecues, you think about hot dogs, you think about burgers, you think about family getting together now that life is kind of becoming back to normal the way we used to know it and love it. And this is one of the things that's gonna gather family and friends around. It used to be that in my house, Tracy was the only one that would do any grilling because it was just kind of hard with the charcoal and the mess and the fumes and the propane. Those things are part of the past. You don't need propane with the Traeger grill. You plug it in. You literally plug it in. It's got a 72 foot cord. So you will always have access to barbecue year round. And this is how it works. See that side bin, that hopper? That's where you're gonna fill up, whether you choose the mesquite or you choose the hickory, you get both. You're getting two 20 pound bags of each. Like I said, I've had mine for two years now. I still have the wood pellets left, but that's, and you can get them anywhere. So if you shop, you know, somewhere that you want more because you need more, uh, you can do that and it's easily available. But it adds that smokiness and that flavor. This is different, by the way, than a traditional wood chip that you can see with regular grills. These are called pellets. They are slower burning. So you've got the ability, to, I mean, that's why they last so long. And you don't have to pick and choose. You get both of these included. If you buy a Traeger grill in your local home store, you know you're not gonna walk out with two free bags of the wood pellets that you need for this to become a smoker. But you will here at HSN. And before we get Danielle back, I know we're, we're reconnecting with her. I wanted to show you the three colors. In fact, Andre, which one is the most limited? Because if the green, the cinnamon is the most limited. Okay, we have less than 300 of these to go around. This is a big time savings. Uh, so if you love that, that beautiful bronze, please don't wait on it. The red in front is called cinnamon. Everything is black except for the fun lid. And I love the kind of retro style of the lid. So this one's cinnamon. And then over here, I love this. I think had we have had the green, when I bought mine two years ago, I would have probably done green, but I did mine in the black. But isn't that fun? And there, you know what? It's just that always ready to serve you whenever you're ready for a barbecue. You don't have to, oh shoot, we don't have any barbecue or uh, charcoal. We don't have any propane or the tank's empty. This is gonna always be ready to go because you plug it into an outlet. Whether you use the chips or not, you can still use this incredible grill as a way to, believe it or not, bake, barbecue, slow cook, braise, simmer. Oh, I'm gonna check my burgers before I lose track. There we go. Oh my gosh, I wish you guys could smell this. Do you hear that sizzle? We cranked up the temperature a little bit because you know what? Some of these, some of these are ready. Oh yeah, look at that, whoopsie. Oh my gosh, you guys, I'm so excited. I don't want to burn that those vegetables in the back. Let me take a couple of these off. Woo, perfect. Move these over a little bit. Move this over here so I can bring those vegetables out to the forefront and get started all over again. Ooh, yeah. Pineapple, have you ever tried grilled pineapple? Let's see, nope, we're gonna bit those back down onto the actual surface of heat so you can get that char on the edges of the pineapple. These little guys, might I might have to get some help getting those out of there because I need a longer tong. But this is another one of my favorite things, roasted peppers. Oh my gosh, I do this. 
I broil these a lot, but you know what? It takes a lot to heat up that oven, and the smell and the taste is actually so much better when you put it over the hot heat, which you can adjust from the lowest low to the highest high, so low that you can do the low and slow, and that's part of the reason Danielle Bennett is the barbecue champion that she is. There's the gauge to show you. It goes from as low as you want and it adjusts accordingly. And you will let this go all day long. When we do a brisket at our house, it takes, I think it's a good eight hours, sometimes 10. But you don't have to keep tending to it. That's the thing. You don't have to tend to it if you're doing that low and slow, but you will love the results. Now, if you're just tuning in, it's a beautiful day here in Florida and I know the weather is coming to where you live very soon. If this is something, if you're thinking about Father's Day or Mother's Day, housewarming present, or hey, let's just celebrate because it's finally gonna be warmer weather. Time to do it is now, and the place to do it is here at over $200 off of the retail price and free shipping. Don't forget, VIP financing for those of you with the HSN card. $50 is all it takes for you to get yours delivered right where you are. But Danielle Bennett is joining us. We're rejoining Danielle. We get so excited about barbecue that things just, you know, I hate to say go up in flames because that never happens with the trigger. Never happens with the trigger. Not ever. How are you? I'm so good. It's wonderful to see you. Good to go. Okay, so you know, I've got you know, grills full of stuff here. But I want to show you this food. It's got the big tomahawks on our first grill today. today so we've got our backyard grilling grill you know your steaks your burger your dogs even a lemon whole roasted chicken then we've got gorgeous barbecue pulled pork championship brisket some delicious lovingly prepared ribs and maybe some smoked mac and cheese oh my gosh now, I know, I know, because we just keep going, right? I know, absolutely. That's but, I've gone through everything that we've prepared I, here, and I know you've got multiple grills going from <laughs> your end. Danielle, tell us from your experience what you would do first if you just got your your Traeger grill delivered. Oh my gosh! Okay, it is. I think you got because everybody so hard, and yet whole pork on a Traeger is one of to eat a lot of pork. You know, one of the books is that put on grill, let it go over here, slow and slow. And one of the great things is the piece just falls apart. So we've got a pork. We're going to grab a pork. Take a look at this. I'm going to actually go work on this. We're going to take that bone. We're going to cut this. Look at this. That bone comes up. Oh, yum! Okay. Remember, we've got now 12 pounds of meat to spread on the grill. Grab a pan, spread it in there, add some sauce, maybe a butt. And we've got a beautiful cold pork sandwich. I mean, this is easy, but all we had to do was. You know, make sure the hopper was full of pellets, that all natural, hardwood, beautiful wood that gives all that great flavor. We've got hickory and mesquite today. Then once that hopper's filled, you put your meat on that's seasoned, you turn it on low and slow, you know, or you can put it on right afterwards. 225, 250 degrees. Wrap it when you get halfway done. And then I'll quick for a few hours, have a couple cocktails on the patio. There it is. Now, I'm going to let you take a nice, big, hearty bite. You deserve it because every... Oh, so do I, by the way. I'll be joining you here momentarily, Danielle. Look at this. There is nothing better than an outdoor backyard barbecue, especially when it's your backyard, you know? So there you see. I mean, the char, that's one of my favorite things. 
As a matter of fact, I hate to I hate to say anything bad about my guy, but when he used to, when he used to use like regular charcoal, the burgers and steaks just never got enough char on them. They were just kind of like, Meh. I like that extra char, and I like the ability that with a grill like this, you can control the temperature. If you're using charcoal, guess what? It might stay at 500 for five minutes, which is where you want to get that nice hard sear on your burgers and steaks, but then it keeps going down, down, down. So before you know it, your burgers are like, hmm, I don't want a eh, burger. I want a crispy burger, a nice char on the outside, but I like that you never lose power because this is a plug-in option, unlike all the other choices. I mean, propane is better than charcoal, I think, because it's not as, you know, fumey and toxic smelling, but you know, Propane, how many times you go out to the grill and you're like, let's do it. Oh shoot, somebody forgot to replace the tank. And there you sit with you know family waiting for something to come hot, um, hot off the barbecue. It's so frustrating not to mention the ongoing costs. You don't have ongoing costs here because this is plug in and play. And this is again the animation. If you're just tuning in, I know everybody's heard the name Traeger. This is why they're so famous. They give you that whole huge hopper on the side, so it slowly infuses the flavor of the mesquite, and of course you're getting, you're actually getting hickory and oak in terms of the wood pellets, and that flavor, oh, it's subtle, but it is just, it makes it very complex. And see how that little auger kind of pulls the pellets in little by little? That's why they last so long. You don't blast through them like you do with wood pellets or chips rather, uh, that, you know, we've used those too. But this, again, I'll go back to the longevity of getting that burner nice and hot. Let's pull that little casserole out here and we'll let that, oh, look at those baked beans with some baby weenies in there. That looks incredible. And then again, there's plenty of room. In fact, let me share with you the specifics in terms of your cooking space, because it's very large. Total cooking surface is 572 square inches. The main cooking surface is about 420. And then that interior shelf on the top back there where the peppers, it's 154 square inches. And like I said, it's a 122 pound grill, but you're not paying to have it shipped to you. Huge savings. Gosh, last week I had to send a letter to somebody. I had to do it overnight, but it was $37. I had to send the title of a vehicle. Free shipping on a grill? It's pretty awesome. And then $200 off the price of what retailers charge. You know, I, I've been there many times to the, to the home stores where I buy my plants and I buy my, you know, other things for the house. Traegers are right there front and center, especially right now. When a time of the year is when you're gonna use the grill now, this is when retailers charge full price. We don't. We've been doing Traeger grills here at HSN for several years and I have to say, this, t this price is like a today's special price. There was one time we had this as a today's special and it sold out. This one, it's back, new colors to me and a price that is as close to a today's special as it could be. Uh, this is your beautiful forest green option. How many do we have of these, Andre? I think we've got about, a, in the green we've got, okay, about 300 of these left. If you want it in the bronze, that one is more limited. We have less than 300. I'm sorry, I think we're calling this copper if you're using express ordering, and it is so pretty. We're good to go here, but we are most limited now in the cinnamon, which is fun. A little pop of color will do, do, do wonders. The classic styling on this with that little chimney, and this is where all the aroma, all day when we're doing our briskets, the smell, I mean, we have neighbors call us and say, are you guys doing a brisket? Can we come over later? Um, but this is, I mean, just such a cool classic look. And again, that's where the smoke is released. This is the hopper. This is where you throw in all of your wood pellets or your, the, the wood chips that we're giving you. Two 20 pound bags, by the way. And this is where you'll set your temperature. The, the I'm gonna call it an auger because my I grew up on a farm with my grandparents in the summers, and we used to haul, you know, in the harvest time, you'd drump, dump all the grain into a bin, and then you'd have to use the auger to pull it up and into uh, the actual grain bin itself. So an auger is what's pulling those pellets into the system, and whatever heat you might be setting it for, it will naturally just let it infuse those incredible aromas and flavors the way you love it. You don't have to use the pellets. You can use it just as is. But I think one of the things that impresses me the most about the Traeger grill 
is that it is so much more than a grill. It's a six in one. You know, you spend how much on a regular grill and it's great because it grills your hot dogs. It, it grills your hamburgers. But this does so much more. You can slow cook, you can slow bake, you can barbecue, you can roast, you can literally bake cornbread or regular cakes and breads, whatever. Braising is amazing because here again, most of your flavors are coming from that low process or that slow process, but you don't have to tend to this. When I'm using my trigger as an actual uh, 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 smoker, that's what I do. I put the brisket in, we prep it, we put the parchment paper around it, we wrap it, we do everything that I've learned from Traeger, by the way. They are great teachers with lots of great recipes online. And then you just leave it in and just let it go for as long as they tell you based on how much you're putting into your barbecue grill or your smoker, because it is six different applications in one. I wanted to double check that, yes, the cover is included. I thought, you know, a sale price, did we take something out? Oh, no, we didn't. You're getting the grill and smoker. You're getting the main grill grate, the extra cooking rack. You're getting a plug-in thermometer. Those are the probes, in fact, right here. These are the probes that you're getting, so you can check the temperature. It was important to get certain things at the proper temperature, namely pork and chicken. You don't want to eat that um, you know, on the undercooked side because it's dangerous. But you do get these, you get two of them. You get the fold down prep shelf that you saw on the actual Traeger, and this is your cover. So protect it when you're not using it from the rain, from the elements. But I mean, even if you live in the cold weather, you're gonna enjoy this year round. Even if it's freezing outside, you can still throw something on the bobby and then come back hours later and enjoy that smoky barbecue flavor that is really one-on-one -on -one with, you know, summertime fun. So we just happen to be here, I believe this is the one and only show all day to feature our Traeger grill and what a treat this is gonna be. Think about it for your home. Think about it for you, for your family. Think about it for dad or for grandpa or for an uncle or for mom. I'm telling you, I can grill now thanks to what Traeger has made uh, possible. It was a dip, little different story when it's over the charcoal briquettes because those just don't like the way they smell and I know that smell is going into the food that I'm eating and I don't like that idea. This is a whole different thing. Whether you use the pellets or you don't use the pellets, you'll love all the way, the way everything turns out from your steaks to baking your pizzas to doing, you know, your baking and your slow cooking. So I, I think that, you know, the key here is the versatility as you see right there on the screen to do it all in one unit that just happens to look pretty darn cool. <laughs> it just, it's just a really cool looking grill. I know you'll have this for years. It comes with a three year warranty, by the way. Uh, a lot of times, at least this has been my experience, one time I decided I'm just gonna get a cheap grill and I'm just gonna use it, you know, just for the easy stuff for the summer. Well, the cheap grill became a piece, you know, something I had to discard after one season because so much heat kind of helped the lower bot or the bottom portion of the grill. It eventually just kind of corrodes and, and eats through the surface. You will have this for years and years and years. Trigger, you know, they, they really do pride themselves on the quality that they bring and they should because there, in my opinion, is nothing finer. In fact, the grill itself, let's look at what you would spend individually here. The grill itself, which is here at under $600, the grill alone is $650 in retail. There's a $50 savings. We are then giving you that front shelf. That would be extra in a store. That's another $60. We are giving you the grill cover in a store. You'd have to pay that separately, $60. And then each one of those 20 pound wood pellets are like about 20 bucks, $19 a piece. So you're getting those included. You tally that up, it's over $800 easily, and you are getting it here at, what is our price? Double checking here. $599. Free shipping and five flex or 12, depending on which card you choose to use. On a regular credit card, it's $120. You pay that now. You will not pay shipping on your first payment like you normally would, you'd just pay the tax. And then next month, it's another $120. The next month, the same for five months, but HSN card holders, you can do this for 12 individual monthly payments of only $50 a month, and that starts right now. $50 right now, you've got your grill on its way. You're gonna love 
having this because it is all about gathering family and friends together to do what we love the most, which is eating and drinking. <laughs> and laughing and telling stories and, you know, having a few beers and being outdoors together. And finally, there's so much that has been lifted from, you know, what we've been through for two years. Bring that family together, to bring them around and let everybody participate or let them sit back and relax while you do what looks to be the hard work, but it really does make it easier on a, on a barbecue grill like this that is more than a grill that has ever been in the past. Six in one, six in one features. I mean, let's go through that again. It is a grill, but it is also a smoker and it's a slow cooker. You can bake in this, you can braise, you can barbecue. And with that advanced, you know, it's, a, it's called the Grilling Logic Digital Pro Controller. That's the little unit you're seeing right there. Uh, you can set and maintain the temperature from smoke all the way up to 450 degrees. And it stays at 450 degrees. It doesn't go lower and lower into five minutes and 10 minutes. And before, you know, half of your food is done or put on the barbecue, you don't have enough heat to be able to get the end results that you're looking for. I like the consistency. I like that this is something that gives you a huge cooking service and that extra shelf in the back. Sometimes you'll use that in fact, let me show you this. Sometimes we'll put our little buns up there, just kind of warm them a little bit, maybe grill them a tiny bit. But what, oh, we've got some bubbling going now on the, uh, uh, the baked beans and the little weenies. And now that corn is really starting to turn golden, isn't it? That's what it is. I think that the key is learning patience sometimes. And with, not to disc regular grills, but I mean, I just like any product that's gonna give me multifunctionality. And this, you just set it and let it go. We're gonna add some more peppers here to just get that nice char. If you wanna put these up on the second shelf, it'll take just a little bit longer and that convection heat will do its magic. But if you really wanna char those peppers up, I do like a char, you could put them right there. I just like the two-tiered cooking option because if you wanna keep things warm or you just want something to take a little longer up top, you don't want it right over that direct heat, you've got that option. But do you see this? cast iron on an open grill. If you've got cast iron cookware, put it on here. It's so great that there's not an open flame. It's not something that's gonna, you know, the, the truth is as much as an open flame can give you the char that I'm a fan of, open flame can really get dangerous and you certainly wouldn't wanna put certain things on them. In fact, that brings me to another point. The grill grate itself, see how nice and close those are? So if you do put a nice delicate piece of salmon on there, you're not gonna have the risk of it falling through the little, uh, the, the little grates. It is absolutely the best. This is, out of all the years I've been uh, a homeowner, which is 23 years this, in, in Florida, my all-time favorite grill. It's just been the most wonderful resource to do the smoking, the, the low, slow cooking. That's why if you like ribs that just fall off the bone, the way to do it is to be patient. Not worry about, oh, it's a hot spot on this side of the grill and it's so cool on this side of the grill, so half of it turns out and half of it doesn't. It's everything turns out consistent because it is that consistent temperature from edge to edge. Something flew onto my barbecue ribs. I have to get it off of there. But the other thing is if you want to put these ribs on the barbecue and then do your barbecue sauce or do it at the very end, you know how that goes. The brisket is going to, this will be your all-time favorite thing. At least for me. And we just, we, we did this whole online cooking class. We, in fact, Danielle will teach you a lot too. You can go straight to her website and she'll give you great Traeger tips. But there's a whole resource of information out there for Traeger. And the recipes, the tips, the techniques, it's become an obsession for so many people because the end result is so good. Chickens don't turn into, you know, dried up little carcasses <laughs> if it's on an open flame where you can't control the temperature from left to right or front to back. You've got the consistent heat underneath without that open flame charring or burning part of it, but giving you rather that more of a convection experience. And that's what makes it just so mouthwatering and fall off the bone. Um, whether it's a protein that you like or the vegetables that you adore, that's what summer is all about. And I have to go back to this one more time. To be able to bake on your grill, that is the coolest thing to me. Uh, baking a pizza 
and getting the crispy results. If you wanted to put that straight onto the grill, cool. If you have a pizza, a stone, you can put it on there too. But the beauty is that it does it all. There's a side benefit here, guys. That's not turning on your oven for maybe the entire summer. Because you know, the, uh, up, the big up, the uh, ovens rather, which are great, they take a long time to heat up. They are expensive to operate in comparison to something like this. And the fact of the matter is, you don't wanna be stuck indoors doing your grilling, air quotes grilling. You wanna be outdoors. You wanna be out with family and friends and beautiful weather and enjoy the smells of outdoor barbecues. And that's why I just like the versatility of my Traeger. I'm gonna give you another update here. We are having the worst time getting together with Danielle. So hopefully we can make that happen before the end of the show. But you know, obviously you can tell I own this because it has just been the best investment. I have it in black, it looks amazing in the backyard. People always comment on it. But I didn't have the option of the green when I got mine a couple years ago. I think this one's really pretty, it's evergreen. Okay, so this one's moving quickly. The most limited choice is there in the front in the red, which I think we're down to, how many, what, 200? Okay, so less than 300, a little more than 200. There's a lot of people making their decisions right now. Uh, the other and third choice is called copper. This one is gorgeous, isn't it pretty? You know, who said a grill has to look like a grill? It can look so much cooler. And it looks like um, there's just stories to be told with a, more of a retro design, but a very smart design. And I like that it's 120 pounds. You want something to be really solid. You want these wheels to be all terrain if you do move it. And we moved ours um, primarily just to be able to clean the, the, the drain system behind it where we have it on the side of the house. Um, it's, it's just so cool to be able to move it. You're not gonna wanna move it from you know, backyard to a neighbor's because you know it's 122 pounds, which reminds me it's shipping to you for free. I love free shipping on anything, especially something that is so heavy that would cost a fortune. Um, and these are all the extras that we are including here at HSN. It's another one of, a wonderful example of what we do differently than a traditional retailer. You'd spend $6.50 for that grill just, and that's what you'd walk out the store with. Um, and you know what? You'd have to get it to your front door. We're gonna deliver it to your front door, no charge. Then put it together. My, Tracy and I put it together, no problem. It was like less than 30 minutes, just the major components that you have to attach. Uh, wheels included, the shelf, because we give you this shelf. This is actually something else retailers charge you $60 for, this front working space, which really is very nice. We use this as a prep station and we use this side uh, of the hopper box to be able to put the next round of whatever we're gonna be putting on the grill. The other thing we've done that turn out beautifully are baked potatoes or sweet potatoes. They're so good. They're so crispy on the outside and so moist and almost fluffy on the inside. So again, these are the extra things we're giving you. Two 20 pound bags of the wood pellets. You're getting the hickory and the oak. We're giving you the cover. We're giving you two temperature probes. There's two little slots on the hopper to show you where to insert and then check the temperature of whatever it is that you're grilling. Uh, but Danielle is rejoining us for the second time. Good to see you again, Danielle. How's it going over there? <laughs> Welcome to Central Florida brownouts and problems. How about that right now? <laughs> well, it's much better. I can hear you much better now. Yay! <laughs> I'm so happy about this. I've got so much food here to share with you today. And it's like killing me right now because, you know, I'm like, I thought the grill's loaded. You know, this is my favorite thing to do. All right, so let's talk about what this grill can actually do. You know, one of the things I always say to people is that any barbecue can cook. This is true, right? but not every barbecue can give you this amazing taste. And that is the number one reason why I have literally for the last 16 years won world championships, done so much all over the world with Traeger grills. And literally this is why I'm so proud to represent them, you know, on a worldwide stage. You know, one of the things is, is that we've got these beautiful versatilities through all the grills. We've got our regular beautiful grill that does you know, your hot dogs, your hamburgers. Take a look, we got beautiful big succulent hot dogs. I mean. Let's take a regular hot dog and jack it up like a hundred notches, okay? Because that wood fire flavor comes right through. We've got big, luscious, luscious ribs. I know Florida loves them some ribs, okay? So I gotta show you. We got some beautiful ribs that are gonna fall right off the bone. Look at that. That's some deliciousness. 
So we've got that low and slow capability. So we've got hot, fast grilling, regular backyard stuff. We've got our beautiful hot dogs. We've got our, you know, our hamburgers. And if you're a little more health conscious, and maybe some of us have gained a few pounds since COVID, we might be going for some lovely fish. So I've got some beautiful salmon on here. Take a look at this. Salmon. Yeah. Look at this. Salmon. Lemon. Rosemary. A little bit of wood fire goodness. And you've got delicious moist salmon for the little healthier program. You know, fish. And the now, whole fish on the grill is perfect. It could be a mackerel. It that? could be your favorite summer fish. My mom loved walleye. Exactly. Some of those are really <gasps> flaky. Yeah. You love walleye? Yes, absolutely. So, like, oh. one of the things is, is it doesn't always have to be about the burgers. Right. It doesn't always have to be about the hot dogs. Here we are, you know, a lot of people at this time of year, they're, you know, they're going and they're doing mm -hmm. a lot of meal prep. So what about all your chicken mm -hmm. breasts? <laughs> I've got a gorgeous lemon chicken here that's good enough for multiples of meals. I mean, that would be amazing, you know, to have that ready for fajita bowls or anything else. And then what we've got, I like to call this the holiday grill. We're coming up on Easter. We all know it's coming. Maybe your family's coming in. Maybe you have a whole bunch of people now that, you know, maybe the world's opening up again. So we're now feeding more people, having more people over. Okay, you ready for this? Oh my gosh, I might die carrying this over. What Check is this going on there? Out. This is a honey bourbon ham. Ooh. And all I did was I scored it. I mixed up a little zhuzhush of bourbon and honey and maybe a little bit of butter, a little bit of black pepper, scored the top, as you can see. And all I did was I put it on the Traeger 275 degrees until the internal temperature got to 165 degrees. The easiest thing ever for Easter. So remember, ease of use. I mean, we didn't have to slave over anything to do this. And look at how big this thing is. It's gonna feed so many people for the holiday season. So tell me what Perfect. you did temperature-wise for that. 275 degrees. For how long? Until it was 165 degrees inside. So that's about two and a half to three hours. That's yeah. It. Wow. And remember, all I did was I put it on the grill. I closed the lid. Yeah. I went and got a cocktail. This is how we roll. <laughs> <laughs> You're my kind of girl, Danielle. It's so <laughs> true. I think so many of us, we've made the mistake in the past with traditional grills, and Trigger is beyond yep. traditional because of the six different, you know, options that you have here, is, you know, yep. set it and forget it. Literally, watch or read the recipes, do it the way <laughs> they have perfected it. And look at this, smoke is billowing out of the little chimney. I love that. You can only imagine how good it smells here. But when you do it low and slow, you, you don't have to keep lifting the lid and releasing all the heat. Exactly. But even if you did, Danielle, I was saying while we were trying to reconnect, is that see that number over there? That number yep. is gonna stay that number because this you plug in. This isn't like propane or charcoal that you know starts hot and then just all of a sudden goes down to nothing. Then you've lost your, you know, your momentum. The consistency of that heat is the key to success for me. Absolutely. Consistent, repeatable results is one of my favorite things as a barbecue champion, yeah. as a world champion, oh. as a mom that cooks with her kids. You know, I oh. want those great ribs. Good job with the, the good job with the burgers. Now I just Don't want to show somebody else, uh, everybody else, this other lovely, wonderful tool that we've got. These are the probes. You actually get two of these with every one of your grills. Now, why these are important is that, remember, I've had that really big roast today, that gorgeous big ham. And I've also had the really big brisket and the pork butt. So one of the great things is you can actually insert this right into your meats and then right into the grill itself. And then you don't even have to open your lid to see the temperature. So you've got this ease of use, this versatility. And of course, once again, it always comes back to taste. You know, taste, versatility for me, that is, you know, the fact that I can go from the low and slow to the hot and fast grilling. Oh, and by the way, I know you were doing burgers. I wanna show everybody something. I have full strips of bacon on my grill today. Now, Ooh. I'll tell you right now, if you tried to do this on, and look at how crispy it is, uh. it's perfect. This is Traeger bacon. This is, um, by the way, this is a Traeger World Championship ring. Look at you, you know, that's how we roll. girlfriend. We got, it's like the Super Bowl, we got Super Bowl rings, you know? <laughs> and one of the things about Traeger bacon, look at how crispy it is. Mm -hmm. I'm a bit, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm on Camp Crispy, okay? Nice, oh, crispy pieces too. of bacon. And here's the thing, if you tried to do this on any traditional grill, you'd have a massive fire. But because we've got that beautiful angle drip pan on the Traeger grills, one of the things that that enables us to do 
It's to cook bacon right on the grill. Oh my gosh. So do you put that on the amongst, main grill? Amongst or everything else. Do you put that on the upper level, Danielle, or do you put it right on the, yeah. on the main? Well, remember, so we have all that versatility, right? So we've got the square foot, you know, the square inches, 572 square inches. You could put it, now imagine this. Say you've got the burgers going on, the bottom shelf. What if you put your bacon slices on top of your burgers? Right. And, or, by the way, you've got that beautiful pot of beans right now. I'll tell you, if we were at my house right now, there'd be some of these bacon slices going on top of those beans. Oh, yes. Now we're talking. <laughs> oh, my God. You're, you're speaking my language. I wasn't going to be here for diet advice today. Not today. <laughs> but I will say, you can do the fish. The fish will come out nice and beautiful and moist, okay? Always. Well, whatever it is, It'll that's what I've been nice saying. Honestly, whether it's fish or it's, you know, my son is vegan. So, I mean, we, we just do a lot yeah. of roasted vegetables in my house. Oh! But the okay, so you talked about vegans. Yeah, but there's lots. Okay, are you ready for this? Yeah. Did you, did you see what's on this one today? Oh, I got your, I got your sun covered. Tell Hold me. On. All right. On the back shelf, soy chorizo and vegan <gasps> cheese stuffed peppers. Oh. Because everybody should eat good food. Oh my gosh. Everybody. You're right. He eats, yeah, he so does the, is... the soy chorizo all the time, but I've never put it on a yeah. grill. I love that idea because it comes okay. in links. Yay. Exactly. So take a look. You know, here's the thing. You know, big, beautiful, gorgeous portobello mushrooms. Okay. That, those beautiful meaty mushrooms. You know, those are like a staple for a lot of my vegan and vegetarian friends because that to them is that steak component. You know, they love that big meaty goodness, right? So one of the things is, is that we serve a lot of those on the Traeger. Season them up, maybe a little bit of balsamic vinegar. Yeah. Throw them on the grill. And actually 350 degrees until they're soft enough. And some people like a little more tough and some a little softer. So I'd start at about 20 minutes and go from there. And one of the great things is about the support network. When it comes to Traeger Grill, thousands and thousands of recipe at TraegerGrills.com plus videos from championship pit masters all over the world and the thing is we just love to eat so we want to share this with the world like the Traeger community is massive and huge and it's worldwide and all of us love sharing things whether it's on our social media channels or Facebook groups or you know mm -hmm. any of those things because it's not just a grill it's a whole lifestyle because here I am in Central Florida right for example I got the burgers, I got the grilled fish, I've got the chicken, I've got the big barbecue stuff, I've got some mac and cheese, we just showed you some vegetarian options. We talked about, you know, the probes and how easy it is. All right, so I'm gonna grab my apron, because this is still hot. Okay, I'm taking one for the team, I just want you to know. How about an apple crumble pie? Are you kidding me right now, Danielle? Apple? No, I don't mess around. I, I, I don't mess around with dessert, honey. Oh, no, no, uh -uh. Okay, now that just took it over the top. And <laughs> I know, right? Oh, you just feel that <laughs> sass. I mean, what a, what a sense of accomplishment to put things on this grill and they always turn out well. I'm glad you just shared what you did about the whole, the, the, the community of support. There are thousands yep. of recipes. My Tracy and I have done the same. We learned how to do <laughs> yeah. a brisket through the website, through yeah. watching a you know, whole tutorial on how to wrap it, how to trim it, how to, what, what to ask for when you get to the, to the butcher's uh, place, and then just set it and forget it low and slow. I've never had better brisket, and I'm a big, I'm very picky about it, and we were just thrilled because it just sat there all day, smelling amazing, <laughs> and I mean, that's one of the many things, but a pie, I love that. I showed some cornbread over here earlier, a all pizza right. that I we baked here. I know you showed the cornbread. Yeah. Do you know what those are? Ha jalapenos? Oh. These are, no, those are jalapenos, but look over on my screen, you've got cinnamon rolls now. <gasps> on top of your cornbread. Because I know you already covered the corn. I saw, I saw your cornbread when we were trying to reconnect. I'm like, oh, girl's got a good, really good cornbread today. You guys look <laughs> great today with the cornbread. And I thought, my cornbread's over there. I think yours looks better than mine does today. So then I threw on some cinnamon rolls. <laughs> <laughs> look at you go. It's really, the sky's the limit. But I mean, Here's what I've been saying all this whole show. <laughs> there are no other grills known to man that you could bake a pie, bake cinnamon rolls, bake cornbread, do a pizza, and that's the beauty yep. of the Traeger. It's so much more than a grill. The consistent temperature, the low, from low and slow to 450, and again, a nice sear like I got on my, on my burgers. Um, quick update, I know we've only got a few minutes left in this show, and I believe it's their only show all day with us. We have this in three colors, and I just wanna make sure you get your favorite before it goes, because that is kind of a heart-sinking moment. This is called cinnamon, and this is the most <laughs> limited. So if you love the, bright, the, the red, 
It's available, but very limited, somewhere around 200 available. This is called copper, and I think this one is stunning. This is the most popular right now. We're sitting about 250 available, that's it. And then we have it in this beautiful green, it's like a pine green, a forest green. Um, there's less than 300 available here too. So, I mean, at a sale like this on at grilling season, while we need grills to take $200 <laughs> off at HSN and deliver it for uh, no charge, free shipping for everybody, no matter where you are, we will get this to you for one payment of 120 if you use a regular credit card or if you have an HSN card. 12 payments. You only pay $50 right now to get yours by putting it on the HSN card and use VIP financing. And this is the whole bundle. You guys are getting it all. You don't need one thing extra. You've got the cover. You've got the two temperature probes. We are giving you two 20 pound bags of these wood pellets. You're getting one in the hickory and one in oak. And you know, what I've noticed, Danielle, is that these last forever. They're not like like the regular wood chips that you've used in the uh, traditional grill that burn up every time you go to use the grill. These stay in that hopper, and you can use them over and over and over and over again. No, they no, last no, forever. No, no, that's not, no, they're not accurate. All right, so here we go. What else do you have to show us? Because I am truly fascinated by the things that you've come up with, ideas that I never thought of before. I happen to have a championship brisket on the grill right now um, because I wanted to show you because I know you love brisket. So I'm going to take a big slab out of this, slicing it right down. It's beautiful and tender. It's delicious and unctuous. And you know, brisket is the make it or break it meat. So here we go. I have to show you this world championship brisket that we've got on the grill right now. You know, one of the things is, is that I love using mesquite and hickory to do both of those. I actually combine the pellets. And you know, one of the great things is that our Traeger locations all over the world that sell the Traeger pellets, we've got a whole bunch of other varieties that are available for you. So you can change them out. You can use whatever you like. But honestly, for me, this is from Texas with love. This is all about the big brisket. Mm. Right. The mouth watering. Mm-hmm. Tender. wood goodness. Mm-hmm. Tender, but it's all about that bark. That's the bark. Mm. That's the key to a good That's brisket. That's where that flavor is. Yeah. Exactly. So we've got all that wood-fired flavor in there. And by the way, once again, let's go back to how easy this is. I put this brisket on at 10:30, 11 o'clock last night. I seasoned it all up after I trimmed it. Mm -hmm. Okay. The hopper was filled with mesquite and hickory. I put the brisket on. I made sure the grill was already running at 225. I had a glass of wine, and then I went to bed. <laughs> About 5.30 this morning, I got up. I looked at the probe temperature. When it hit about 160, 170 degrees, I wrapped my brisket this morning, and I went and had coffee. Because <laughs> remember, repeatable, consistent results is where it's at. You know, brisket prices, not exactly the cheapest uh, you know item right now. So let's show you how easy it is to use this grill. You plug it in. You fill the hopper up with all natural wood pellets, which are amazing. You set your temperature to whatever you want, low and slow, hot and fast. We've got it all. And you've got the full spectrum and range of temperatures to utilize. Now, once the temperature knows what you want it to be at, that auger is going to pull through the pellets as you need them. And then they're going to burn into that hot pot. Now, that hot pot, as it's mm -hmm. burning, mm -hmm. is going to release all of that delicious wood-fired flavor from those all natural wood pellets. Now it's gonna envelop all of your foods, whether it be vegetarian or big steaks or everything in between with all that wood fire flavor. And the best thing is that angle drip pan, all the grease goes into that bucket and that's it. I mean, I, come on, ease I, of use, convenient and so easy to clean up too. I know, I, I, it is <laughs> for sure. I mean, it's so well designed and I'm so glad you, you went through all of that again because this little bucket is gonna hold all that grease. You, and, Fill it up, it's a huge bucket. I mean, you can empty it any <laughs> anytime you want. And I love the way the smoke billows from the chimney. I just think that is such a, it's just a fun design. This hopper it's is iconic. the magic. This is the magic where you get to keep that temperature as consistent as, as it is. And no grill offers you that consistency. Grills start out great and then they just lose all their steam or their heat because Briquettes, you know, fall into the into the bottom, and propane ends up running out, and you never can see can maintain a consistent temperature. 
but you can see here, you can start as low as you want from slow cooking all the way up to a nice 450 degrees and it'll stay exactly at that temperature. These are the probes, uh, the, the little ports that you put the probes in to double check the temperature of whatever it is that you're doing. And again, whether it's grilling or barbecuing or slow cooking or braising or baking or doing any of the modes, Ah, oh, the Traeger is the key. That one is copper. That one is the most limited. We have it in a cinnamon red. We have it in a forest or pine green. Literally now just a couple, like 200 of any option. So many people listen, watch, learn. I mean, Danielle, she is a world champion master barbecue uh, award winner. I mean, she's got the ring. She has done this for years, <laughs> and I love your passion and how you share with us the ideas that you've tried. And back, that reminds me, back to all the support you get with the TraegerGrill.com, all the recipes and ideas that is there for you all the time. Amazing community. I've got to show you a couple more things. Okay, one of my favorite go-to mm -hmm. things. Okay, you ready for this? These are regular burgers we threw on the grill. And look at how luscious and moist that is. That is just a burger elevated by all of that wood-fired, all-natural wood-fired flavor test. And this, all right. You all know what this is. This is a prime rib. I just cut it oh. in half. It's dripping all over my hand, and I'm here for it. Because mm. you know what? Look at how beautifully juicy that is. Mm -hmm. Beautiful bark on the outside. Mm. We've got this delicious Traeger prime rib rub all over this. Remember, prime rib is a premium meat. We don't want to mess this up. So once again, we came back and we utilized those beautiful probes so that we didn't even have to open our grill. That probe just goes in the thickest part of the meat. We plug it into the grill and we don't even have to open the lid. We can see the temperature right there. So no messing up. Remember that consistency that convenience of putting this on, or like the ham for the holiday season, super simple. Um, I have children, I have three children. They're wonderful, but they eat a lot. You know, <laughs> they all do. And they're always hungry. I have a 15 year old boy <laughs> who is constantly hungry. He, he is never not hungry. Do you, do you know this program? Are you familiar with this program? I know every mom and dad out there is going, yes. Okay? So we talked about pizza. So this, look at this. I want to show everybody the bottom of the pizza. And I think this is really important. Good point. That everybody sees how golden it is, okay? Yeah. So we're not getting a, a overcooked pizza. We're getting this beautiful golden color. This is a regular frozen pizza from the grocery store, mm -hmm. okay? The kids can, my kids use all the grills. And that's the other thing I love about the convenience factor. I don't have to be there with them. If they can run their phones and goodness knows every other social media program, I'm pretty sure they got the whole Traeger grill down pat. <laughs> And then some, okay? And You're plus, hilarious. we have a lot of younger... Well, yeah, it's true, you know. I'm, I'm all for, you know, child labor and empowerment. I'm telling you. <laughs> you know, they well, should all cook. And it, let's let's facilitate that for them. <laughs> let's share the love, right? I mean, it's true. But, <laughs> yeah. but as a mom, I'm sure if it was an open flame, you, you would probably feel a little differently about that. This is, this exactly, is a whole... I would different category of, of perfection. I mean, it's just been such a treat to have this brand at HSN. I, I am thrilled that I got mine. Uh, I have a black. I love it. I've had it two years. It has just been a workhorse in my life. These are the colors we have to share with you today at this sale price and literally do it before they go back up because you know what the price is doing oh, yeah. everywhere, including merchant a product like this. The grills in retail, you'd be looking at over $800 to get what we're doing here today. I mean, you'd have to buy the pellets separately, and they're 20 bucks a bag, so, you know, $40 worth of both hickory and oak, and then we're giving you the cover. That's a $60 extra. We're giving you that front that front prep tray or space, a station. That's another $60. You'd want it, but you'd have to spend extra to get it. Our, our value is amazing, and especially right on the heels or right at the beginning of what's gonna be the biggest season for grilling, the best summer we've had in years because finally things are feeling a little back to normal. So Danielle, thank you, thank you, thank you for joining us. You're welcome, sweetie. I'm so glad I could be here. Remember, you can cook, bake, roast, smoke, yeah. everything on a Traeger. And by the way, you can also barbecue and grill. So remember everybody, you know, life's too short for bad barbecue. So get the right barbecue to do everything you want. Absolutely. Taste the difference. It makes a big difference. The flavor is incredible. Thank you. Be well. We have copper. We have it in the red, which is called cinnamon. We have it in the green. Final quantities and the only show all day. So grab it while you can at that sale price. Have a wonderful day. I will see you again back here tomorrow for Saturday morning.
With the power of HP from HSN, reinvent how you work, how you play, how you live. Technology that makes life better for everyone, everywhere, and deals designed for every budget. HP on HSN and at hsn.com. Get ready for spring with two days of deals on our biggest brands with fresh ideas for your home, garden, and kitchen. Join us all weekend on HSN and at hsn.com. You can't afford not to be brave. It's not even an option. When life puts a wall in front of you, you break it down. Remove the fear. Remove the uncertainty. Be authentic. Hey, fortune favors the bold. I've been bold all my life, and I don't plan on stopping anytime soon.